Welcome. How you doing? I'm doing great. You're soaking it all in, I see. Right? No, y'all look beautiful. Y'all look beautiful. I love this. You look spectacular. I mean, this whole everything. Thank you. Everything Thank is you. stunning. Look at you. Shout out to my mama. She styled me. Hey, your mama. mom styled yep, you. Yep, yep, yep. My mom. What? Okay. Me. What style advice does your mom give you? Um, you know, just. I, I'm, okay, we're trying to find a little mixture because I'm a big sweat pants and hoodie girl. And she's like, <laughs> wow, you're going on Tamron Hall. You got to look nice. So I'm going to make sure, you know. But no, she just trying to keep me in the latest drips. So I love you. She's yeah. mission accomplished. I love it because it is proper sports star and hip hop star, exactly. which is where you are. Both of them. Both of them. All right. So, best advice you've ever received. The team told me you went to a philosopher, Lao Tzu. Um, the advice, the man who loves walking will go further than the man who loves the destination. Mm -hmm. Why did that speak to you? Um, because when I came in freshman year, as you see when I wrote down, like, I was really goal-oriented. I, yeah. like, I want to win SEC freshman of the year. I want to win a championship. I want to do all of this other stuff, right? But now, when I'm going to this season, my goals are different. My goals are like, I want to be consistent. I want to be dedicated. I want to be disciplined. You know what I'm saying? Things like that. So I think I think I just like learned to fall in love with the process. And then once you fall in love with the process, the goals won't even matter because like you'll end up surpassing those goals. Right. Yeah. Like, I love yeah. that. Okay. I got to give the graduation speech, so I'm going to write that down for the speech I'm giving on Saturday. Oh, no. Yeah. Uh, your endorsement deals, over a million dollars, because people yeah. want to be aligned with you. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's a big deal. First of all, so happy the rules have changed, yeah. but that also means that they see that your brand yes. is money. Yes, yes, yes. Absolutely. Your brand is quality. Yes. Um, I can't help but to think about, of course, your father, mm -hmm. who passed away before you were born. Mm -hmm. But you got your rap start on America's Got Talent. You're 14. Yes. Um, it's a hard question for me to ask you, but mm -hmm. I thought a lot about it last night. Look at you at 14, just owning right, that mic, right, just right. attacking <laughs> it, attacking it, attacking it. Your father, Jason's uh, hip hop name was Camouflage. So, mm -hmm. uh, what what advice? It's a hard one. What advice do you think he would have given you based on everything everyone told you about him? Man, um, it's, it's, it's like for me, that's kind of the answer that I've been searching for my whole life. You know what I mean? And I can only go by what my mom tell me. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you act just like him. You have a, a kind, positive spirit just mm -hmm. like him. So, you know, the only, only, only advice that I can really take from him is when I listen to his music and I just try to be just like him. And I'm just trying to imitate everything he does, like, to the T, you know what I mean? And, and, and I think we just connect more through music. And that's why music has just become so important to me because it's like, I feel like for a long time, it was just a missing piece of me, you know, without my dad. But now I just feel like we can connect through the music. So I just think he would want me to keep being me, keep being kind and keep inspiring yes. me. So. Yeah. I'm all tearing up over no, here. No, I know, I know. Um, I, I just love you so much and everything that you're doing. And even in the hip hop space, you know, I'm a huge supporter of female hip hop artists. We had Glow on here, Big I'm not Glow. I love Glow. Yes, we have Big yeah, Glow. Glow. And many others. And I love that you have your debut EP, Both, Best of Both Worlds. It drops later yes. this month. Tell me this, I, I love the art here. Yes. It's like you are in a whole nother galaxy, baby. Yeah, yeah, and I yeah, love yeah, it, yeah. I love it. So you've signed a deal, Jay-Z's Rock Nation, so they're working with you. Yes. Lil Wayne, your yeah. connection there. Yeah. I mean, you are best of both worlds for real, but, yeah. <laughs> but, but it's you. It's, the yes. light is all shining on you, yeah. even with these big stars around you. Yeah, I mean, Honestly, it's just my time. You it know? is. It is. <laughs> and, yeah. Yeah. And and I say that I say that so humbly because you know I've been in certain rooms before, right? Yeah. 
And now I come back and I revisit those rooms and I was like, wow, I was a whole different person when yeah. I came here, right? Like, and I used to wonder like, you know, why they not trying to help us? Like me and my mom, we've been grinding this thing out since I was seven years old. Like I've been rapping for a long time. Yeah. And to finally be able to walk in those rooms and get to the point where you don't even have to introduce yourself. <laughs> it's like, you I know, it's, it. it's, it's, it's like a game changer. I love it. I have to, like all my praise and everything that I am, I just give it to my mom because she raised me to believe that I could do anything that I put my mind to. Yeah. Like, my mom, yes. Like, my and mom. you're one of six, right? Yes. One of six. The only girl. My mom was the de <laughs> My mom was the, yeah. And my mom is the epitome of a hardworking woman. When my father died, it was just her. Mm. And she took care of me and my brother. She put us in private school by herself. And I, I know how hard that is growing up now. I'm like, wow, mama, you, <laughs> like, you really okay. super okay. woman. Like, I don't super know how woman. you did it. And so. Yeah. Everything I am is because of her and how hard she pushed me and how she never took no for me. Okay, well, first of all, that is so beautiful. And it just hit me that Mother's Day is in a couple of days, so yes. you can just get mom to rewind that yeah, and yeah, over and over yeah, and over. Yeah. Okay, so you came out with a basketball. You have written advice on the ball mm -hmm. that you have with you. Where is it at? It's on that side? Yeah, yeah. It's on okay. No, it's on this side. On this side. Okay, you've written advice, and you have a lot of fans in this audience oh, over here. Yeah. is not holding on to it. It's like music. You want to share it with to. other people. OK, so you've got the ball. You ready to pass on the advice? Yep, let's do it. Oh, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it.